do you believe in others you know what I mean like how and, and I say this with, with such a heavy heart and something that is, I'm so passionate about and it's like how often are you investing in the individuals around you how often whether it be like that person is older than you whether it be that person is younger than you how often are you going to invest in someone's strength how often are you going to shoo away their weaknesses because you know every single person around them is already doing that shit for them how often are you going to lift someone up up on a hard when they have a hard day how often are you gonna take someone I don't know maybe on a drive to just talk to them because they they're not being heard freaking all day they've been been talked down to their entire life they've been through rough times their entire life you never know what someone's going through until you actually just sit down and listen we got two ears and one mouth and I know I talk a lot I get it but at the same time I'm the first person the first person to sit down and listen with an open ears and an open heart to see how I how I could affect you in a positive way and believe in your process believe in you believe in your strengths you know exploit your strengths rather than hiding your you know like hiding your weaknesses and and freaking or exploiting your weaknesses I'm never gonna be the person that says hey you need to freaking work on this crap because you suck like I'm never gonna say that I'm gonna praise your freaking strengths because if you focus on your strengths and you do that, and that's all you're gonna do. Your weaknesses automatically are gonna be brought up to the level where your strengths are at. And so, but it all starts with believing. It, one, you gotta believe in yourself. You gotta believe in your abilities, right? But then two, if you're just believing in yourself and you're being self-centered and selfish, you ain't never gonna change the world. You ain't never gonna affect the people around you. And I've one time in my career, I was told by one of my a phenomenal leader that I had in my career, right? He said, squeaky wheel gets the grease. And I was like, well, what does that mean? You know, and so I've literally held on to that for my entire career now, seven years. I've been the squeaky wheel. I've been the wheel that's always gonna, that's always gonna say something, that's always gonna voice the opinion, that's always gonna be like, hey, hey, here I am, here I am, right? Because eventually, eventually, if you're consistent, and you're saying stuff and you're believing in people and you're believing in the process, eventually something's gonna give, something's gonna happen, something's gonna change. One of my videos, whatever, whatever, like, will get shared on someone's wall and someone will see it, right? Like, that video I just did, someone hit me up, thank you for that. That, like, changed my mood 100%. Like, that's what it's about, believing. Believing in people, investing in individuals, investing in the process, investing in believing in that you could change the world with one simple simple word with one one single time you sit down and listen you could change that person's life you could open them up and actually you know like see and see things through their perspective that's how it is that's what you should do and that's what I plan on doing that's how I'm gonna like that's what that's what legacies built off that's how you get, are remembered because you've invested into people you've invested into their them not just you but before all that happens you've got to get yourself right you gotta believe in you. You gotta believe in your strengths and identify them. You know what I mean? But the question is, how often are you gonna believe in others? How often are you gonna believe in the relationship that you guys have? How often are you gonna believe in the interaction that you guys continue to have on a daily basis, if not weekly, monthly? Right? Do you need to contact that person more? It's just, that's what you need to do. So, food for thought before I pull out of the parking lot. You know what I'm saying? Believe in people. Invest in individuals. Invest in your relationships that you have. Because one day, you know, take one for granted. And that one person they took for granted ain't never going to come back. So invest. Invest.